Hello everybody. We hope you're having an amazing day today. For us, it's been a great one since we're getting ready to discuss one of the greatest mysteries of Yellowstone so far. Is Garrett dead? Now, if you have watched Yellowstone season 4 finale, you know that it was depicted as if Garrett had been killed by Jamie through a very dramatic series of events. His death was shocking, disturbing, and pretty unexpected for many of us. Patricide has always been a taboo issue for literature and cinema, since Shakespeare utilized the concept through his famous character, Oedipus. His exploration of the concept resulted in much other artwork that tries to dive into the darkest sides of the human psyche, and we can confidently claim that Yellowstone has been the last one to do so. And yet, we also have to admit the fact that such a move was a little bit bolder than we expected and even hoped. Not that it was bad, but it was very uncalled for. Was Garrett's death truly necessary? Is Jamie a character who can kill his father? As Yellowstone fans, were we ready to see one of our beloved characters going into that road? Well, we're not sure. Thankfully, when we got deeper into that season finale, we realized that things might not have proceeded as we initially thought. Okay, as Yellowstone enthusiasts, we all know that the show loves to surprise us with many twists and turns. For the most part, the show doesn't hesitate to trick its audience by placing some hints here and there to make them guess what to expect. Unfortunately, though, not many of those hints are being noticed before the twist takes place. This means that the show is quite good at hiding those hints and deceiving its audience. This might sound disturbing at first, but, to be honest, it's one of the biggest reasons why this show is so great. As far as Garrett's death is concerned, we can now go back and say that, yeah, throughout Season 4, it was heavily hinted that something horrible will take place between Jamie and Garrett. Even though it wasn't very difficult to guess, unlike most other Yellowstone mysteries, we struggled to guess the extent of how horrible it will be. So when Jamie gave in to Beth's pressures and decided to kill his father, we were truly shocked. Our initial reaction was to be disappointed by Jamie since his personality so far didn't give any indication of committing such a dreadful crime one day. But then, since this plot made the show more exciting than it was, we accepted the incident as it is and didn't question whether Yellowstone tricked us or not. Now that it's been months after Yellowstone Season 4, we can confidently claim that there is a high chance Jamie did not kill Garrett. How? First of all, Jamie has never had the guts to do such a thing. Second of all, he is smart enough to mislead Beth if he has to. Thirdly, he is not stupid and as a man of law, knows that it's almost impossible to commit any murder in the modern day without being South. So, we believe she might have found a way to make Garrett seem dead and in the meantime arranged a safe way out for Garrett to have so that he wouldn't have to deal with Beth's anger once again. Is it impossible? Not. Therefore, we expect Yellowstone Season 5 to welcome back Garrett as a fugitive probably in Canada or Mexico. It's very likely that Beth will find out about this and will track him down while forcing Jamie to join her. What do you think about Jamie and Garrett? Would you like Garrett to be alive or not? Let us know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.